All right, guys, what's going on? It's Norman Lee with Norman Lee Fishing and the Deck Talk Podcast. Today, we're going to talk about something that happens, well, quite honestly, it's the most frustrating thing that could happen to an angler or a fisherman on the water throughout the course of the day. And we're talking about using spinning equipment and your line twisting as it comes off your reel or twisting up as you go to make a cast. Now, I want to show you a couple different things you can do as an angler to kind of help eliminate that from happening. Now, one of the ways you can help prevent your line from twisting up is the way you spool it onto your reel from the spool of line. Now, if you take your spinning rod, hold it in your hand so the reel is facing away from you, your bail on your spool is always gonna rotate from top to left. So the rotation of your bail is gonna be top to left. That is the same direction you want it to come off your spool of line as it's spooling onto your reel, top to left. That's gonna help prevent a lot of those twists you're gonna get from spooling it on your spool the wrong direction. One of the things that could cause your line to twist up throughout the course of your fishing day is looseness to the spool as you're fishing it, winding back on your spool from casting loose. Now one of the things you could do is actually crank your outboard up and cut your bait off. Let your line free spool as you're idling with your outboard. Let Basically you're going to spool your whole reel out the back of your boat. Uh, let Once you get it all stretched out, continue idling for about 15 seconds, then reel your line all the way in with tension on your line as you're doing it. That's going to actually help untwist the twist that your line has and you can continue fishing. Now one of the biggest things I see people do as they're fishing with spinning equipment is the way they cast their line and the way they actually engage their bail. Now most people I watch throw a spinning reel. When they make their cast they try to crank their bail closed with the handle. That's the worst thing you can do uh, for really two different reasons. Uh, if you ever notice when you try to crank your bail over with your handle, there's a lot of pressure, there's a lot of tension on that bail before it actually clicks. Unless you get a run and start with that handle, it's going to have a lot of pressure. Well, that's not a good thing for the mechanisms in your reel. It puts a lot of pressure and strain on that reel, which in long term is going to cut down the longevity on your reel itself by trying to close it with the handle. What you want to do when you make your cast is you want to manually, with your, with your hand, close that bail. That's going to save the longevity of your reel but the other thing it's going to do is at the end of that cast just take your your hand and basically pull tight on this on the line before you actually start reeling it back what that's going to do typically when you have a major twist up and everybody's done it i don't care how good you are at throwing a spinning reel you have done this before you make a cast and all of a sudden your line comes out in three different pieces uh, and it goes almost through all your guides the reason that happens is when you close that spool down inside your line it's creating a looseness every time you close that bail and that is causing that line to actually eventually going to loop off of your spool as you make a hard cast and that is a nightmare to get out so remember always close that spool by hand not with your reel it's going to save the life of your reel as well as help keep that line tight down inside that spool as well now that's about it guys if you if you use those simple techniques we just talked about it's going to make life so much easier on the water when you're trying to throw your spinning reel but anyway give those things a try see if they work for you and trust me they will because the last thing you want to do is get out on the water throwing your spinning equipment trying to have some fun and your line keep twisting up on you it could cause major problems and it's the most frustrating thing i'll ever go through guys until next time i'm norman lee with norman lee fishing and the deck top podcast have a good day hope to see you on the water soon and remember always live the passion